we saw that there are two separate streams of connections which link the primary visual cortex to the rest of the brain, the dorsal visual stream and the ventral visual stream. The dorsal stream is a system of neural pathways that connects the primary visual cortex at the back of the head to the motor systems at the front. The job of brain structures in the dorsal stream is to determine where in space everything is and how to interact with the spatial world at a split-second precision. The ventral visual stream, on the other hand, connects primary visual cortex to memory and language systems. Its job is to construct what we would usually think of as conscious visual perception and the objects and colors and motions in it. This neurological organization immediately tells you something interesting. Think about how important it is for the racer's brain to determine where everything is in space. What's the braking distance? Where's the apex? How fast am I traveling? How much runoff is there? And so on. And then consider this. The main job of the racer's brain is knowing how physically to interact with the car and with the racetrack. These are all questions for the dorsal visual system. What we experience as visual perception and the features of the world that we can see in our mind's eye, talk to others about and communicate in words. What psychologists refer to by the word introspection. These are not the whole story of vision in the brain. The dorsal visual system works at a blink and you miss it time scale and also most of the time below the threshold of awareness, which means you cannot find out how it works simply by looking into yourself, I mean by introspection. The key to understanding it is in terms of different coordinate systems and transformations between them. What do I mean by that? Visual input from the eyes is registered in a retinal coordinate system. That means that everything is basically indexed relative to gaze direction, up, down, left, right in the visual field. To control action, however, motor commands have to be given in muscle coordinates. Move this muscle or that muscle, turn the head, push the legs, and so on. And further, in order to sense your own position in space, you need to determine how your body and your visual field are oriented and moving relative to the direction of gravity and relative to the stable environment. Keeping these different coordinate systems in register relative to one another is what the dorsal visual stream does.